Hey y'all. Um, I'm Amy because I got reminded to introduce myself because I forgot last week. Welcome back. Floss tube number seven. Can you freaking believe it? Like, I feel like these are just whipping by super fast. So, another Wednesday. Kids have early release today. It's 11 o'clock. They'll be home by one. It makes for a very short day. Um, so my game plan, I have to make some cards. I have, um, samples coming in. Ooh, totally brain fart. Sorry. Did you, did you see it happen? Um, I have samples coming in for Color Street. I just ordered some twosies. So if you've ordered from me and you haven't received a thank you card, that's the reason why I'm trying to get my samples in. So that way I can send you a sample with my card and all the thank yous and all the stuff. Um, so I have to hand make some cards because those are coming soon. Speaking of Color Street, I have total brain fart. This one is called Coral Coast. These guys and my touchdown. Yeah. So touchdowns being retired. There's a couple of them that are retiring. I don't know what's going on with my phone. I was trying to mess with it earlier and it's doing like this focus in and out thing. Maybe if I just had my TV on, so I think maybe the flashing of the TV on my face, maybe, I don't know. Anyways, so we have a couple of colors that are going away. So if there are certain ones that you want, get them now while you have the chance, because once they're gone, they're gone. So I need to get my butt on there and get me some more touchdown because I don't know if there's another style coming out or not. We do have a fall release coming out. I am super stoked about from what I understand there are 29 colors and we don't have a release date everyone has their fingers crossed that it's going to be by the end of this week or beginning of next week so they're so pretty um I can't I just can't they're oh, they have all sorts of gorgeous colors and stuff on there and I've gotten to see a few of them from what I understand there's 20 nine I think I said 29 I think there's 29 colors coming out and I think I've seen flashes of 12 of them and the 12 that I've seen gorgeous I can't wait so there's my update on the color street so if you haven't gotten a thank you card it's let's be real it's because I'm a jerk um because I'm waiting on the samples to make the cards to mail them out and all the fun stuff I don't usually wear t-shirts, so if you see me messing with my shirt, I'm sorry. And it says, <laughs> sorry, not sorry, which is fitting. But anyways, my mom got it for me, and so I'm not used to, I'm always in tank tops. But anyways, this week has been crazy, but not necessarily in a bad way. So last week, we were gone like pretty much all week. The, my boy had wrestling practice on Monday. My girls had band practice on Tuesday. We had a family night opening up the new playground on Wednesday. And you'll hear me talk about my kids a lot. Little Miss Scarlet, my youngest one, her principal and vice principal have pretty much already decided that when she is old enough to be part of student council, they're just gonna give her the presidential position and just let her run the school. So she wanted to be there for the grand opening for the park because she helped, I guess, with like a lot of the planning last year, which I didn't even know about. Anyways, she's now doing an anti-bullying campaign. Please keep in mind, she's eight. I don't know how many of you at eight years old were doing this sort of stuff, but she just like... blows my mind with the stuff that she comes up with. She wants to do fundraising for anti-bullying t-shirts. She wants to do contests. She wants to do all sorts of stuff. So she's already found, um, she doesn't want to be president of it because I don't know. She decided she wanted to be treasurer. So she's letting one of her other little friends be the president and vice president. And she's talking to her vice principal. They have meetings every Tuesdays at lunch. And she's, I mean, she's just running with it. So I help her out in any way I can. Um, so there's that with little Miss Scarlet. That was Wednesday. Thursday, the boy had wrestling. The girls had practice. 
Friday, the girls had a game that they had to attend. So we were just go, 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 go all week. I, however, I write down what I pull every week because I can't remember. We've mentioned this a few times. So don't mind the chicken scratch, but can you see, let's see, where are we? Here's Wednesday. This is when we did the floss tube six last week. I got dragon kin. My son, oh, focus. My son pulled I Love Cats because I let my kids spin the wheel so it holds me more accountable. Dragonkin, Dragonkin, Dragonkin. I can't make this up. Oh, you don't need to see that. Where am I at? Right here. Here we go. Okay. I got diamond painting on Monday, Dragonkin again on Tuesday, and today Scarlet pulled Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. You guys, I had four flipping days with Dragonkin. Technically five, right? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, technically five, because I pulled it on Wednesday. I had five days with Dragonkin. My wheel was really loving Dragonkin this last week. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, I got a freaking page finish. And I think that looks so cool. The colors in here are just gorgeous. I love them. And my little donut over here, if I could figure out my finger is my little donut over here. I freaking love this thing. I do. Can you see my needle sticking in it? So let me explain why I love this thing so much. Because first off, it's a freaking donut. Fat kids don't say no to cake. Um, Second off, I have a nice strong magnet on the inside of it. Uh, I almost stabbed myself. Okay. I didn't kiss my stuff, but I almost stabbed myself. So I have a really nice, where's my camera? A really nice strong magnet that I crocheted inside of it. So that sucker's not coming out. Magnet on the outside just snaps right to it. Okay. There's only one magnet. And I stuck it right here on the bottom. So all this open space right here holds my parked freaking threads. I'm a genius before I even knew I was a genius. It's awesome. So I just pull that right there, park all my threads on top, and this just holds them down. So there we go. I did it because I thought it was cute. Whoa, focus. Okay, no. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Okay, so when I crocheted that, I thought, man, this is stinking cute. I didn't realize how functional it was going to be. So I keep my needle out of my mouth now because when I would flip my Lowry stand and I would, um, you know, end my threads or whatever, I would put the needle on the back end of the magnet and then snip and then flip. But before I flipped, I would stick my needle in my mouth and then flip and then re-thread the new. I don't know if I'm explaining this right. It's not the point. The point is... Now, I just pull my needle off the magnet, flip, and stick right into the pin cushion, because it doesn't matter where I stick it, it just right in. So, if y'all are not watching Michelle, who is Bendy Stitchy Michelle Garrett, you should. Um, that woman is just phenomenal. And it's so funny because she keeps gushing over McKenna right now, which McKenna is also fantastic, so if you're not watching her, I don't know where you've been, stitching in sequins. But, um, the way she gushes over McKenna is the way I gush over Michelle. That woman is phenomenal. Her Alzheimer walk, her fundraising, the stuff that she does, it's just phenomenal. And you guys are even more amazing because you guys donated all this stuff to her so that she could do the sale. So that she could put her stuff up on Bendy Stitchy. So she could do these auctions. And you guys have helped her out tremendously with a subject that is very, very close to her heart. So if you want to learn more about that, head over to Bendy Stitchy. I will try my bestest to link her down below. I'm pretty sure all of you know who she is. Like, 
I'm just saying. I'm pretty sure you all know who she is. But if there is someone out there who is watching me who does not know her, I will try to remember to link her down below so you can go check her out. Um, I'm one of those type of people that my brain doesn't stop. Can you tell? Have, have we met? Okay. My brain doesn't stop. So just because she's coming to an end for her, her Alzheimer's, my brain is just beginning because I'm late to the game for everything and I just got started in this community and I don't want it to end anytime soon. So my brain is spinning for next year. I plan on crocheting donuts with purple frosting. Um, I'm gonna try, Alicia, I may need your help. Okay, did you take a minute? Did you let that sink in? Okay, cool. I want you and me to collaborate together on a hope blanket in crochet, in purple, somehow with sparklies. We'll figure this out. You and I will chit chat. But speaking of Zakira, am I two for two? Did I say it right? How the fajoli did I not know that you had a frickin' channel? What? And you have a Ravelry? Okay, so... I don't know how I don't know this stuff until it's too late. And what is that? Oh, <laughs> I'm trying to crochet a baby blanket, which we'll get to the topic of in just a moment. And I just confused myself. It's, I need to go to my Instagram. Sorry, y'all. This is what it would be if you were hanging out with me. I think, please don't make any noise. I'm getting closer to finding her. Uh, YouTube channel. Okay, Lady Wings, not Wings. Wing, as in one, Lady Wing Crafts Podcast. It looks like she, you, do you do a lot of crocheting and knitting on here? Is it just knit? I haven't had a chance to watch any because I was just floored at the fact that you had a channel and I didn't know and I felt bad. It looks like knitting. Am I wrong? Am I right? You'll tell me. Either way, I don't know how to knit. Knitting and I don't work well. But I'll still watch you to hang out with you. Um, so that's her craft channel on YouTube, her podcast. I'm going to go check it out. I don't knit, but I'm going to hang out with her anyway because that's just what I do. And so, um, yeah. How the Jolie did I not know? If you have a channel and I haven't checked you out, link it down below. Just tell me where I need to go and I'll watch and I'll hang out. So there's that. Speaking of baby blanket, because I was doing calculations on how big I needed the blanket, which I'm not very far. I'll show you anyway. It's pretty boring right now. That's it. As far as I got. Boom. I'm going to do a waffle stitch. Whoa! Chillax, yo! Are we good? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. My camera's drunk. That one shot last time was just a little too much. Okay. I don't know why it's doing that. Stop it. If anybody can give me tips on a, I don't even know what I have. Samsung Galaxy 9 Note. The one with the pen. Help. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. I will apologize for that because that's just my phone being a jerk. I have no control over its jerkiness. Anyways, I'm going to do a waffle stitch on that because my husband and I discussed over the weekend I'm going home for a couple days. So we're going back to Las Vegas, Nevada over the weekend for my kids. I almost said spring break. Let's not rush this. Their fall break. We'll be out there for the weekend hanging out with family and things like that. And my friend Casey, the one that I've been talking about, who just found out they're having a girl, that's going to her. And I'd much rather have it stitched up and, and hand it to her than try to mail it. Because that thing is going to be a beast. I have five, 
by stripes. So I'm using this one. I really don't like the fact that my phone is, am I moving too fast? What's, I feel like if I take my eye off of it, and this one. So I'm gonna use these two together and waffle stitch it. I think it'll be fun. Nice and muted, nice and bright. That's what we're going with. So, oh, are you focused? Stay focused. Stay with me. Okay. So there's that. And then, I'll show you my diamond, because I haven't really been stitching on anything else but the dragon can. So I got another section of my fit. Oh, my fairy. Tiny arms, I feel like a T-Rex. Middle arms. So there she is. She looks a lot better further away than she does up close. I keep saying that only because it's true. Because <laughs> her face does not look that good up close. Here. Well, you all know. When you stitch and... Whoa, I can't see you. Oh, and you can't see her face. Oh, my jeez. Not a trained professional, y'all. Okay, well, it doesn't look that bad. Whatever. Prove me wrong. It's fine. I'm used to it. It's all good. It's all good. It's fine. Anyways, it doesn't look that good when you're here, but you all know that. And I say it every week. But she's turning out fantastic. That top strip. Woo, mama, it's time to put some color in. Okay. A top strip, that's all I got. I'm almost done. So I just need the wheel maybe two more days to favor the diamond painting and she'll be done. And when she's done, I'm gonna frame, it's up there. I don't know if you can see that little white thing right there by my finger, above my finger, in there, is my other diamond painting, the one with Khaleesi and the dragons. And then her, I've got the frames, so we just need to frame them. So those will be, almost done. The only thing that I don't like about this diamond painting, and this one I got from Hua Can, which I'm a little disappointed in, is that my darker color diamonds are like huge. And so it's buckling my painting. So I'm hoping that when I get it up against the frame, it'll, it won't, they won't fall off. Does that make sense? I know what I'm saying and it makes sense in here, but once it exits, something happens. Anyways, so there's that. Dragonkin page finish. Whoop, whoop, super excited. Um, I'm a little behind, though, because technically I wanted to do a page finish a month. <gasps> My light bulb just clicked on. Did you catch that? Dude, it's September 5th. I started August 1st. I got two freaking pages done in almost a month little over a month. I'm ahead of the game, y'all. I'm ahead of the game. All right, now I don't feel so bad. Okay. Oh, my cat. I don't like this one. I don't like this one for the same reason I don't like the dragon one. Where'd you go? This guy. We have a love-hate relationship. Oh, I thought I showed you the pattern. Anyways, it's this one. Super cute, super little, right? No. <laughs> no. I'd rather work on the dragonkin. Okay. This is how far I got. Now, I don't know about you. These cats kind of freak me out when they don't have eyeballs. They look like angry gerbils. Do they look like angry gerbils to anyone else? Is it just me? I got a whole lot farther on this. Um, I'm going to try to be better. I make no promises because we all know by now we're on episode seven. We all know by now that me and memory were not friends. I can't remember anything, but I kept my old phone so that I could take pictures of, whoa, oh, there's me and the hubby. That's my husband. Not that that's focused, but whatever, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna try to remember to take pictures of my progress so I can show you the before and the after because I can't edit that in. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to do it. 
and it's fine. So I'm hoping to have the baby. I have to work on the baby blanket. I've got, we're leaving on the 21st. I look at you like you know. <laughs> I think we're leaving on the 21st and coming back on the 24th or something like that. So I want to get that done before we even go so I don't even have to worry about it. Because um, I don't do very well in car rides because my back is not very cooperative. But I am thinking of taking this one with me. Could I do that in a car? I've never stitched in a car before. I hear it's not easy. But there's a lot of counting in this, so I don't know if this is a good idea. I don't know. I'm debating. I'm debating. I might end up just taking this whole little folder with me, and then I'll have a whole bunch of different projects that I can work on. And they're all, I mean, they're not all smalls, but for the most part, they're pretty little. I'm not taking Dragon Kin. I had a split second fart of, I'm going to take Dragon Kin with me. And then I looked at my book, and I looked at my pattern, and I looked at the, it's too big. It's just too big. I was trying to figure out how I could set up the Lowry stand underneath the car seat and make it like, it's too much. It's tempting. But it, I think it's too much. My husband can figure out a way to make it work. I'm freaking taking it with me. And I'll just take my book, my little file with me. So. There's that. Oh. Because I'm random. Um. Also doing another giveaway this month for the color street. So if you put it in an order with me, your name goes on the wheel. I'm not doing the pen thing. The wheel was so easy. So I'm just going to keep, because I'm obsessed with the wheel. Anything wheel that I can put on a wheel to spin the wheel, I'm obsessed. I'll do it. I'm in. So you get this cute little bag. And I lost the zipper. You get a cute little nail polish remover pump. So you just put your nail polish in. Pop your lid, cotton ball goes on top, squish, squish. Beautiful, one of my favorite products. One of these as well. I was talking to someone else and forgive me because I think it was Brenda. Was it Brenda? I'm pretty sure it was. This is the nail block that I was talking about. So you have four steps on here to file, smooth, buff, and shine. And I use this religiously on my nails. So I take them off, I do the nail polish cleaning, and then I let them set for about 10, 15 minutes just to kind of let everything chillax a little bit. And then I use that, clean my nails off with the nail prep pad that you get in your kits, these guys. And then I stick my nails on and go to town. You're also gonna get this cute little nail file that says sing, because that's been our thing this week. We've all been singing. And because I think all of us women need to take better care of ourselves, a healthy little snack it's called Cranberry Blend. And these are good. They're delicious. So that's going to come in your kit. Your little, that's the giveaway. Boom. So if you put in an order with Color Street, each order will get a entry. I had to think of what I was saying. I was getting there. And we'll go from there. I think, I think next month we might boost it up a little bit. So for every item you order, your name goes on the wheel. Let me know what you think. So that's this month. Um, no haul. I got some yarn, obviously, because I need, because I need more yarn. That's like a seamstress saying they don't need fabric. And so I showed you cat, dragonkin. Those are the only two stitchy things I've worked on. Twinkle Twinkle got pulled today. I'll probably work on that later tonight because it was... Stop it! Stop it. Focus. I have a hard enough time focusing. I don't need your assistance. Phone. Focus. Okay. Got a couple more panels done on my diamond painting. See, I already forgot because focus. Working on the blanket, following a tutorial now on YouTube by Amanda something. 
I really need to get better at writing down names. I'm so sorry. Um, I think that's it. I think that's it. Oh, I have my coffee cup. I like this one because of what it says on the inside. Oh, can you see it? Be brave, be bold, be you. And it's gold leafing. I got it from Joanne's a while ago on Clarence. I think that's it. Quick and easy. What stories do I have? Do I have any stories this week? I may not have a story this week. No, I do have a story. I just can't remember what it was. That's the story of my life. It'll come to me, and as soon as it comes to me, time will run out. What was it? What was I going to share with you guys? Traveling to Vegas. My son turned 10 yesterday. Couple digits. Oh man, I can't remember. I'm trying to think about what we did all week. See, this is why notes are important. Because I had a story. I had a story. I was super excited to share it with you. I'm going to have to leave you all hanging in suspense. What was it? I don't know. It apparently wasn't that amusing. My son got a huge Star Wars Lego set that he built in like four hours. I wish I was kidding. I'm not. I told him his goal in life is to engineer for NASA and buy me a house. Yeah, it's not coming. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to write it down and keep you in suspense for another week because I can't. I can't think of it. This is why it's hard to be me. Because I can't. I just can't. I can't even. <laughs> Alright, I guess that's it. Boring week this week because I got nothing. I worked on Dragon Kin and nothing else. Nothing exciting happened this week. I think it's because we were just so go, 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 go. It just didn't stop. I did have a lady at the Buffalo Wild Wings ask, ask if she could keep me. <laughs> that was amusing. Yeah, that's it. Now I'm just rambling to just a ramble. Okay, I'm going to see you guys all next week. Um... Us being on vacation shouldn't affect anything because I'll be home Wednesday to Wednesday. Wednesday and then Wednesday, if that makes sense. Probably have to kick my kids out. Because if I let my kids stay in the house when I'm recording, they're all going to want to be on the video. And no. I think that's it. So, new tagline. Are you ready? What was it? <laughs> Stay random and don't kiss your projects. There it is. We'd get there eventually. So I introduced myself. Floss Tube 7. Stay random and don't kiss your projects. I'll see you guys next week.